please stand for the pledge? I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Please take a moment of silence to reflect upon your day ahead. Good, wonderful Wednesday morning, Margaret Mead students and staff. I'm Cheyenne. I'm Nathan. And we're here with today's headline news. Today is September 25th, and today is National Daughters Day, National Lobster Day, National Binge Day, National Comic Book Day, National Cooking Day, National One Hit Wonder Day, and it's also National Quesadilla Day. So cook up some quesadillas, listen to your favorite one hit wonder, read a comic book, and binge a couple of your ep couple episodes of your favorite show to celebrate today. Our celebration of Hispanic History Month continues. Music is a powerful expression of culture, and today we celebrate a living genre salsa music which originated in the Caribbean, combines elements of jazz, Cuban sun, and Puerto Rican bamba, and has become a global Hey Mustangs, looking for a way to relax and recharge? Mustang movement and meditation meets tomorrow after school. Join us in room 201 for yoga, mindfulness, and self-care. There's always room for more. Come for more. Come find your zen and finish the week strong. Your parents can order hot lunch and pizza slices for you for the months of December, January, and February. If you'd like the hot lunch and or pizza ordered for you, please have your parent or guardian follow the directions in Mr. Ross's Mead Minutes. Hello Mustangs, the Aspiring Teachers Club is starting next week. If you're interested in, in entering a career in education, this club is perfect for you. We will be meeting every Tuesday after school starting October 1st. The permission slips are in the cafeteria. Please see Ms. Galeski with any questions. Hope to see you there. This year's PTA reflection theme is Accepting Imperfections. We would love for our Mustangs to show their incredible talents in the categories of dance, choreography, film production, literature, music composition, f photography, and virtual art, visual arts. Please see flyer and application in Mr. Ross's Mead Minutes for more information. If you have any questions, please see Ms. Heinlein or Dr. Coy. Attention all soccer players, going to Adams for tomorrow's game. You must be dressed and ready to board the bus no later than 2.30. Do not put on your soccer shoes until we arrive at Adams and take them off before we board the bus back to Mead. Make sure you have a full water bottle before we depart. All students, parents, and staff are welcome to come to Adams to root on our Mustang kickers. Hello tennis club members. Due to the rain yesterday, Tuesday's tennis club was canceled. All of Tuesday's to Tuesday's member, members can join the Thursday group. See you out there. Now let's shoot it, shoot it over to Colin in the sports corner. Hey, it's Colin here with today's sports report. Due to the rain, the Mead crossed country teams ran in busing fashion to sweep the Eisenhower Eagles. Yep, that's right. We're, we runners are crazy. Nothing stopping us here are the results followed by Meade's top runners and three Sigma efforts. Sevy girls smoked 19 to 14. Winner was Sa Sadie C and Sigmas were Jolene K and Ava T and Avery H. Sevy boys rocked it 20 to 41. Winner was Ramey M and Sigmas were Owen M, Owen D, and Charlie B. The 80 girls peaked 15 to 56. Winner was Carolina B. Sigmas were Clark, Garza, and Maddie S. The 80 boys galloped 18 to 43. Winner was Victor O. Elevated Sigmas were Thomas W, Chase R, and Otto A. Congrats, everyone. The eighth grade girls basketball team defeated the Keller Wildcats last night 29 to 13. Using a pressure packed defense, the Mustangs held the Wildcats to five points in the second half. Well done, ladies. Congratulations to the seventh grade girls on their victory over Keller. The girls played tough defense, allowing only one basket in the second half, winning 22 to six. Great win, ladies. Hey Jordan, what's the weather going to be like today?
Jordan here with today's weather forecast. We did wake up to a bit of fog this morning, but it should clear by the clear by late morning, making way for plenty of sunshine today. We did get some more of that much needed rain yesterday, but it should remain dry today. The warmer weather returns today with highs in the mid 70s. Now let's send it back to Cheyenne and Nathan at the news desk. Today's birthday shout out goes to Anastasia F. Happy birthday. That's all we've got he here for you today. Please remember to be respectful, responsible, and safe. Make it a great day, Mustangs. Bye. Bye.